Pokemon Day is six days away and we've just had the announcement of the next Pokemon Direct. We're going to cover all the details on that as well as the next upcoming seven star Terror Raid event in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. But before we get into today's video, please subscribe to the channel. Remember, you can always unsubscribe later if you would like to. So like I said, we've just had the announcement of the next Pokemon Direct. It is going to be a big one. It is for Pokemon Day and will be happening on the 27th of February. So we can hop over now. Pokemon have just put a tweet out. The next hashtag Pokemon presents is on the way trainers. Tune in to our official YouTube channel at 6 a.m. PST on February the 27th for about 20 minutes. So a lot of content we're going to get of exciting Pokemon news in celebration of Pokemon Day 20. 2023 and then there is this little video to go along with it so we'll play that hopefully the sounds all right for you guys it's a very nice little video teaser and very i don't know if there's given us hints here with the gen 1 music let's have a quick look at this bulbasaur venusaur yeah charizard blastoise oh it's the kanto pokedex Kanto Pokedex up to Pidgeotto. And then the Gen 1 music. Big hints at what will be coming. And I think it has a lot to do with the Virtual Console, the Game Boy Virtual Console. If that was my, that would be my best guess, I would say, in a big hint. But you know how much Pokemon loves Gen 1 as well as the original game, so it could just be a coincidence as well. But I do feel like with the Game Boy Console coming onto the Switch, the silhouettes of the Kanto Pokedex or the start of the Kanto Pokedex in that silhouette circle before we get the information, it does seem like that's going to happen. And obviously with it being 20 minutes long as well, we're going to get a bunch of stuff. We'll cover everything from the Switch side of things, from Pokemon Go, Pokemon Masters, Pokemon Unite. We're going to get an array of announcements for a bunch of Pokemon games and things going on TCG as well, obviously as well in there. So that is a lot to look forward to. Monday coming up, 27th of February, 6 a.m. PST, which translates into about 2 p.m. UTC and then 9 a.m. Eastern time. So translate that into your relevant time zone. We'll be streaming it here live on the channel if you are interested in coming and hanging out. Probably we'll start the stream an hour earlier before the present starts, get the hype going and then enjoy the presents together and see what we get going into 2023. It's going to be a big one. Okay, on to the next thing. So the next seven star terror raid event has been announced and it is going to be all based around Pikachu, the mascot of Pokemon, which is quite fitting for it in commemorations with Pokemon Day and the weekend of Pokemon Day happening. Uh, we're running from the 24th and actually this one looks like it's going to be an extended time period. Normally they finish on the Sunday evening. It looks like this one from the information that we've got here will be finishing on Monday the 27th of February. So on Pokemon Day itself at 23.59. So if this is based off Japanese time that will mean it'll be about 2.59 UTC time. So as soon as we do get the a full confirmation of this event over in other time zones then we will confirm it but it does look like it will be the regular starting time of midnight thursday evening rolling friday and then running right through all of pokemon day up until the end of pokemon day and that's when it'll finish but it'll vary time zones depending where you are uh, you can only catch one pikachu per save file it does have the mightiest mark so it will have that uh, seven star feature and obviously it will be a pretty tough battle i think it's going to be probably tougher than people expect i think because of its electric typing it will have access to some of those big signature electric type attacks that pikachu does have access to probably has lightning rod as well and you could imagine a held item something like the light ball we can just speculate at this point but maybe not as tough as some of the other seven star raids that we've had in the past but who knows uh, but a nice event i think all the same so for pikachu and you never know they might give us a boosted shiny chance encounter of the seven star raids although all the other seven star raids have been shiny locked so let's probably not expect too much from this event but like i say running this coming weekend so not very much time to prepare for it uh, but running 
in conjunction with Pokemon Day. And as soon as we do get further information on the event, of course, we'll cover it here on the channel, especially when the event goes live itself. And if you would like me to do some best builds, examples for this Pikachu, things like Gastrodon are going to be really good into this one with that water typing that it's going to have access to. You're going to think that it's probably going to have something like Surf maybe as a bonus move. Uh, Gastrodon are going to be really good, especially with that ground typing and the Storm Drain ability as well. You're going to have to watch out for things like Grass Knot, which Pikachu, I believe, does have access to, which could be a little problematic. But some big news today. Like I said, the big one is going to be the Pokemon Directs that is going to be happening on Pokemon Day on the 27th. And this link here just refers us to the Pokemon YouTube channel where the Direct will be happening live. And I don't think there's been any updates on the channel yet. Uh, to say anything different no so this is where it will be live and on the times that we've discussed in today's video what are you expecting us to get in the presents though that is the big thing that's the big question that i've got going into this are we going to get the dlc information i'm pretty certain that we're going to see dlcs confirmed for pokemon scarlet and violet I really am confident that we're going to see the Game Boy games dropping on the virtual console on the Switch, at least red, blue and yellow. I would imagine those will get dropped as well as maybe something like Pokemon Stadium and then everything else is up in the air. There's lots of speculation and leaks, things going around at the minute, especially about Mystery Dungeon and other games as well. But I'm sure there's a few surprises in the pipeline that Pokemon have for us and hopefully they're all good ones that we'll enjoy. But like I say, we will be streaming it here on the channel on the 27th at 2 p.m. UTC. We'll start about an hour before. I'll make sure the schedule's up in plenty of time. So if you would like to come and join us and hang while we watch the presents, I would love to have you join me. So thank you so much for tuning in. I look forward to hearing all your comments below. What do you expect us to see from the presents this coming Monday? And I am so hype about it. I'm so hype about it. And I cannot wait for it. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in, friends. Hope you found today's video useful. If you have, uh, please drop a like. Subscribe to the channel for more of this sort of content. And I will catch you all in another video very soon. So until then, friends, Take care of yourselves and bye-bye.